Hi everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to be filming a fashion video. So many of you have been asking to see more fashion related videos. So that is what I'm filming today. I recently went into Zara and I picked up lots of lovely pieces for spring. And I thought I would do a Zara haul and share with you guys what I've bought, how I would style it and how you can transition the items from now into spring and summer. So if you want to see See what I've been buying then just keep on watching. For this season I'm really into very pastel colours, very neutral colours, blacks, whites, nudes and pinks so a lot of this stuff is following that colour palette, there's nothing too bright or crazy in this. So the first thing that I picked up was this crop top and this is just a plain black crop top and it has this really lovely ruffle detail on the straps and then also on the hem around here and this is so flattering, it makes your waist look tiny because it's really tightly fitted here and then it just slightly flares out where the ruffle is. The fabric's really nice and thick as well so it gives you a really nice structured shape once you've got it on and you may have already seen if if you follow me on Instagram if you don't I will leave a link maybe here somewhere um, maybe down there maybe somewhere else maybe just in the description box if I can't figure out how to do that if you follow me on Instagram then you would have seen that I have already worn this and I wore this with some black high-waisted flared trousers and it just looks so lovely in the summer you could even wear this with like a white pair of trousers if you kind of wanted to go for like a monochrome look it would even look lovely with like a pair of high-waisted denim shorts high-waisted jeans it is such a versatile piece you can really dress it up for a night out or for dinner or you could wear it casual during the day and if it does get a little bit chilly like this time of the year it's not overly warm I feel like it's only just acceptable to start kind of wearing crop tops out I would just put a little jacket over the top the next thing I picked up was a bit of a basic for me every year I like to buy a new pair of white skinny jeans I only really wear high-waisted jeans just because I find that's most flattering and I always like to either wear a crop top with them or I like to tuck my top in and I just feel like with jeans that sit on your hips tucking a top in just isn't that flattering because you're not really accentuating your waist and if you're wearing a crop top with hip jeans I just feel like there's too much of my torso on show so that is why I love to wear high-waisted jeans so these are just slightly off-white they're more of like a cream color but I know that once I wash them a few times they will fade out to white but I do love the fact that they are slightly off-white and the thing I love most is the frayed hem at the bottom of the jean and I'm really into this at the moment I just think it looks so nice with like a pair of heels I just think it really adds a little extra something a bit more detail to the jean and I love the way that these fit they are super skinny normally I don't love Zara jeans because I find that they don't fit me very well but these ones are from their premium denim collection and I would wear these all throughout spring and summer and obviously you can wear white skinny jeans with pretty much anything but something I always look for in white jeans as well is to make sure that they're not see-through I would rather just pay that bit of extra money to get a nice thick pair of white skinny jeans that you cannot see my underwear through it so that is my other purchase then I bought another crop top and I am in love with this one. This is lace and I just love lace for this season. This one is lovely because it's kind of like slightly lingerie style. Like it has like an underwire effect like you would get in like a bralette or a bra. Um, but there's not actually um, wire there so it's really comfortable to wear. It just has the effect of that. I really love the way that this sits as well. And you just have the nice little lace hem here which is really pretty when it's on. I also love the colour. I don't own many things this colour but I think this colour and white look amazing together. This is definitely something that I'm going to save for springtime and maybe pair with a lovely pair of white tailored trousers or white flared trousers and it would look lovely on holiday with a nice pair of shorts as well. So this is so pretty and I really love this. I haven't worn this yet. This was £18 so not bad at all. So I'm really into tailoring at the moment like I love a good pair of tailored trousers, a tailored blazer, I absolutely love the Balmain blazers, I think they're amazing, I just cannot bring myself to spend that money on them, so I'm going to look for a slightly cheaper high street version. 
version but I haven't actually come across one yet but when I do I will definitely let you know but something that you do find on the high street a lot is a lovely pair of tailored trousers and I love Zara for their tailoring I think they make such amazing clothes for such a great price and it is usually quite good quality as well so a few years ago I would never have even dreamt that I would be in my early 20s and be wearing tailored trousers I just thought it was something that always older women would wear but then when you get in your 20s well for me anyway I love that sophisticated really elegant chic look and I've been really into tailored pieces at the moment and I absolutely love wearing a good pair of trousers I feel so feminine in them and I kind of feel like a bit of a girl boss as well when I'm wearing like a really nice tailored or smart suit or even just a really nice pair of trousers and I just think it's such a great alternative from wearing jeans as well so I never thought I would see myself in trousers until recently so I've picked up these black pair of trousers from Zara and they're just a black tailored pair of trousers but they kick out at the bottoms so they're really tight on your leg and then just as they get like halfway to your shin they slightly flare out now I already have a black pair of flared trousers but they're like jersey material and they're kind of like a legging slash trouser like they don't have any pockets or anything so when I saw these I just thought they were kind of like a step up from what I already have and I just love the way that these are like a proper pair of trousers you've got the pockets you've got things what are these called you know things that you can put your belt through loops they've got loops that you can put your belt through and I love that as well. They sit high-waisted of course, I have everything high-waisted and they've got pockets at the back as well and I'm just going to show you them on because you can't really see them with me just holding them here but I just love the way they fit and they have this seam that runs straight down the middle of your leg as well which really gives that kind of expensive tailored look. Now I would probably pair these trousers with that black crop top that I showed you earlier, the one with the ruffles on I think this just looks like it's a made suit like it looks like it's supposed to be put together and I would also wear this with like a black lace body or a little black slip top with some lace on it or something something really feminine I am just obsessed with the way that these fit I feel amazing in them they fit me so well now I did get these in an extra small and they are very tight like I do struggle to get them on but I just find that they fit a lot better especially around my waist because if I was to go up to a small I think that they would be just be a little bit too baggy around my waist so I did get the extra small and I just squeeze into them and they're just a great smarter alternative from my jersey flares as well that I got from ASOS and I think I got them in the cell for like eight pounds like it was amazing and um, I posted a picture of me wearing them on my Instagram as well and so many of you asked where they were from so I will list them below um, as well as the Zara ones so you can check both of them out that's if I can find the ASOS ones because I did buy them in the cell a while ago but I'm sure I'll be able to find similar ones anyway then continuing my love for trousers I bought a pair of trousers in this season's most popular shade this beautiful blush pink and these are like a loose pair of high-waisted trousers and they're like a lovely kind of silky material they hang so lovely they just skim past your legs and give you a really nice shape and they have this waistband up here that's slightly thicker so this really accentuates your waist and keeps you nice and tucked in while the legs slightly flare out so you're not completely losing your shape and I just thought these will be so pretty in the summer if you're going on holiday as well they will look lovely again I would just wear it with a crop top or like a little lace body something quite feminine and pretty and last year I actually bought the same pair but in the white version here they're so lovely I've got like a white skinny pair of trousers or like slim fit pair of trousers but I do love a wide flowy leg I just think it's really elegant and feminine and pretty then I picked up a basic and I bought this charcoal just grey v-neck t-shirt and I love Zara's t-shirts I find that they're really nice and soft and I just got this to throw on with a pair of high-waisted blue jeans 
or again like a nice pair of trousers and what I quite like to do with this is tie a knot in the side just so that it kind of brings it in it makes it slightly cropped and I think it just gives it like a really cool casual look and it obviously makes you look like you have a bit more of a figure as well rather than just wearing a baggy t-shirt but I do just love a baggy t-shirt tucked into a pair of jeans it's just such an easy throw on look and I actually bought this t-shirt in a size medium just because I wanted it a little bit oversized and baggy because I found that these small kind of clung to me a bit more especially on my arms and I kind of like a t-shirt to be quite loose and like slightly boyfriend fit without being like totally oversized you completely lose your shape so I love Zara's t-shirt so I picked this up in the dark grey but they've also got tons of colours they've got like black white I think they had like a lighter grey as well so if you're looking for some basics Zara is great for these then lastly I bought this jumper that I'm wearing and this is just like a dark grey knitted bat winged jumper and it is so unbelievably soft and comfortable. It is so snuggly, I love it. It is quite warm so this is probably better for springtime. I wore this the other day and I tucked it into a lovely pair of like white tailored trousers and it just looked really smart and it kind of has this like ribbed effect on it. And it's also slightly cropped as well, so it sits really lovely. And for me, it's great because, as you know, I love to tuck everything into high-waisted jeans or high-waisted trousers. So you're not left with too much fabric to kind of try and tuck in your jeans or trousers without leaving a mark. You can just slightly tuck it in. And again, this is just another great throw-on piece. And I just love to keep these kind of basics in my wardrobe for any days that I'm struggling with what to wear. And they're also great because you can mix and match it with so many different things like I would wear this with a white pair of trousers I would wear it with a blue pair of mum jeans I would maybe even take it on holiday with me for evenings when it gets a little bit chilly with like a pair of denim shorts so that is it for this haul these are the pieces that I bought from Zara I love all of them I think they are such great transitional pieces as well and you can mix and match all these pieces together because the color palettes all go really nicely together I love a staple piece that can carry me through all the different seasons classic pieces that look expensive but are really inexpensive and that is what I'm really trying to work on with my wardrobe is buying pieces that I can mix and match with other items in my wardrobe I love to buy like designer handbags sunglasses accessories but when it comes to ready to wear I always buy from the high street because I get so fed up with my clothes so quickly that I don't want to be spending lots of money on ready to wear pieces that I'm just going to wear a couple of times and get bored of so I absolutely love the high street for ready to wear and Zara is one of my favorite stores so I really hope that you enjoyed this Zara haul if you did and you want some more fashion haul videos then please give the video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you're not already and hopefully I will see you all in my next video. Bye!